Hey everyone, uh, Donnie here. Today I'm going to show you an oldie but a goodie, and that's the Paiute Deadfall. So stick around, watch the see. I know you'll enjoy. So let's take a quick look at some of the uh, components of the Paiute. First and foremost, we have our rock. We want a rock to definitely be heavier than the intended uh, prey animal. So if you're going after rats, squirrels, those usually go anywhere from you know half a pound to a pound. So you want something that's going to be at least 10 pounds or five pounds. Uh, just think about you want it to be an insta kill. Uh, next, we have the trigger bar, which is right here. This is exactly where we're going to pin a piece of bait to the back of this guy right here, or we're gonna put a bunch of bait along this actual stick so a name animal comes up and uh, starts monkeying around with the bait, whether it's a fish head, some tied on worms, um, any sort of berries, nuts, whatever the case may be, he's gonna hit that uh, trigger bar and it's going to drop the rock. Here we have the toggle. The toggle is providing pressure to the trigger bar backed up against just a spot on the rock. You kind of see it doesn't have to be anywhere in particular, but you want it to be uh, nice and flush and, and sound. Then we have the cordage, which goes to our lever bar, to our upright bar. The upright bar can be a Y fork, it can be a seven, it can be a, a simple split notch. Uh, however you can get this mechanism to sit and stay in place is gonna be your best bet. A y fork is real easy. Um, but cut notches is just a you know another step in the process so adapt and overcome so again we have our our upright which is a y fork our lever bar our cordage our toggle and our trigger bar basic pieces your upright your toggle your cordage your lever bar and your bait stick so again, we'll push bait to the back and we're gonna pin the bait here. We're gonna smear it all along the stick, but we wanna make sure said name animal is underneath this guy. So one thing that we'll do is on this far side over here, we'll block this off. We'll also block off this side right here and showing that the animal comes in the direction that we want. Animal comes in and just gently pushes down on this guy and it's coming hard. All right, I'll set it up for you again. All right, there you have it. Maybe. A little closer look. Woo! Getting windy. Another angle, we've got the uh, bait stick pinned up against it, tap, down it goes. So that's it, Paiute Deadfall, it's a classic, it's been around for a while, it's been catching rats for God knows how long. Um, if you're into rats and you like eating rats and squirrels, by all means this is your go-to. Uh, so you, again, you got the uh, bait stick, your toggle, your cordage, you've got your um, upright support and your lever arm. Bottom line, this is a pretty uh, decent trap. You can set four or five of these up uh, in a general area and then set another four or five up close by, especially in this area where I'm at where there's lots of rocks and little nests and stuff. This is ideal. Remember, big stone, block off your sides, and you'll get dinner.